A big night for the Iowa GOP, unlike any other we've seen this cycle. We're creating opportunities for them just as it's done for us. Nearly a dozen potential presidential candidates addressed this room full of GOP activists. Well, I got news for you, Mr. President. And it didn't take long for Republicans to criticize the president and, of course, Hillary Clinton. We can beat Hillary. We must beat Hillary. We will beat Hillary. I think Hillary Clinton, by her failure to defend Benghazi, by her failure to defend the ambassador, should forever preclude her from holding iron office. But not because she is a woman. She must not be president of the United States because she is not trustworthy. She lacks a track record of leadership. Each candidate only given 10 minutes to make an impression. Fiorina was the only one to get caught off. Another major focus, national security. Iran, enemy. Israel, friend. Israel, friend. <laughs> I came over across the Mississippi. Top-tier candidate Scott Walker didn't get quite the same reaction from this crowd as he did in January. I look forward to seeing him in just a few minutes down in our hospitality room where Governor Brand said he'll appreciate this. We've got cheese. Following the speeches, this crowd of over 1,000 had the opportunity to meet face-to-face -face with each candidate. Sorry, sir. Asking them questions of their own and posing for pictures. This event, sold out with 1,300 people, is one of the biggest Lincoln dinners so far. In Des Moines, Samantha Joe Roth reporting.